Okay, Reg, I'm here, and you were right. The needle's tricked out with all kinds of electrical crap and what looks like a bad aluminum siding job. You're gonna have to get to the top of the needle. It's a nice day. I'll just climb to the top. Climb. No, no, no. Don't be crazy. Right, hey, man, it's not crazy to be awesome. Hey, Reg, hypothetical, you know, theoretical, totally what-if question here, but... What would be the explanation for how I might be able to draw the power from some conduits, say, oh, I don't know, Hank, and not others, like one of these dupe troopers? Oh my god, so you did try earlier. Hey, I'm not looking for an I told you so here, Reg. I'm just looking for an answer. Dupes had those things locked down. Well, I suppose that hypothetically, theoretically, it could be you can only drain powers from a conduit who has them naturally. A prime conduit like Hank, or hopefully Augustine. I mean, the DUP guys got all their weaker powers from Augustine, so maybe they can't pass them on. So you're saying we have to keep going. Read you loud and clear. Don't push it. And next time, don't lie to me, okay? Trust your brother a little more than that, will you? Man, this stuff's even uglier from the inside. Looking forward to taking this stuff down. Hi, Betty. I'm at the Space Needle. Oh, I'll, I'll try back later then. Bring me a postcard. <laughs> okay, the gift shop's open. Bye, Betty. Bye-bye, dear. Aren't you a sight for some... This is more like it. I'm on the uh, observation deck. Don't let your guard down.
All right, time to gouge out the eye of the needle. And that must be what holds it all together. What the hell? Well, I haven't seen you before. Rex, man, they got a small army up here. Good. Means they're in the right place. Or that they really don't like other people playing with their stuff. Come on, focus, Delson. Do you see any way to take down the communications? Yeah, yeah, there's this uh, anchor. Looks like it's holding all the antennas in place. I don't think this is gonna cut it. Nothing bad ever came from getting new powers. is going to be epic! See? That wasn't so bad. Yeah. Well, isn't that better? Woo! That's a rush. It goes away. Center District. I lost you. Do you read me? I'm getting nothing, sir. You? Nothing outside our immediate area. Yeah, Reg. Let's go find us some prime conduits and get some new powers. We own the streets! Take it easy. A few streets in the immediate vicinity, right? The DUP still owns the other 98%. But we kicked them off the Space Needle, man. You knocked out their comm center, okay? They may be deaf, but they're not dumb. Kicking the DUP completely out of Seattle is gonna take time. We just got here. You know what they say, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single kick-ass tag. Who, who says that? The Chinese people. Hey, Reg, you see it from down there? <laughs> Are you kidding? People in Portland can see it. I just want to let the dupes know I'm here, man. Who the hell is that? That's not one of the three who escaped. That's cool. What's the symbol supposed to be? Not sure. The banner man got away before the Delson, I've been asking around about the escaped bioterrorists. Do you think I maybe need like a PR?
People here are starting to call me the Banner Man, which, A, is unbelievably lame. Uh, maybe not the best idea, you hanging around the Space Needle right now. Look, I'll keep trying to get a lead on the escape bioterrorists. Why don't you see if you can disrupt other DUP operations around there until I get back to you? Terrorists to escape from the bus crash. Fine, lay it on me. I'm still at the station. Not a great place to talk. Uh, I'll meet you at 4th and Vickers.
Well, that hit the spot. time.
tasty. Bannerman. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Nelson, sorry man, I got hung up, but I found out there's this bioterrorist maniac. Yeah, I just heard, and can we please not use the B word? What? A bioterrorist? Yeah, you know, that's just a slur invented by the DUP to make people scared of conduits, man. Look, whatever you want to call him, let's just track him down find out what he can tell us about Augustine. And drain his powers. Okay, fine. And drain his powers. I'm telling you, it's gonna work. All right, they just found a body at Fifth and Briar. Go check it out, but promise me, you'll be inconspicuous? Yeah. Listen, Delson, it, it's gonna be police officers at this crime scene, okay? Not DUPs. Now, I'm here to support you, but killing cops... I got it, I got it. I'll put my phasers on stun. Okay, I need a year away. I'm past your boys in blue. Thank you. Although, what's the use of having smoke powers if you're not gonna use them? Ah, that's my baby brother. Well, found the victim. Definitely the work of a conduit. It's very... showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. There's your wounds. I wonder what kind of power did this? Fire blast or lasers? Ooh! What about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well, you know what? If it does, my first victim, it's gonna be the guy who came up with the name Bannerman. Bro, you really need to let that go. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. Yeah, the DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out.
chances are there's going to be a lot of DUP Jeez, there. Right. DUP Place with the shoot. With you really want to catch wow. this guy. Wow. Well, hate to interrupt this little pep talk, here. but yeah, well, so is mine. No, nothing. The victim must not have had a record. Huh. From the looks of the guy, I at least would have expected a drug bust or two. Get the conduit! Jeez! And good luck with that. Well, this conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, I just
just need... Let me guess. Face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble. All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. I got a hit on the face. Guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. Might give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Another sniper going after him. Be careful. Real original advice. Wait, 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 wait. Don't impale me. I come in peace. It's okay. It's okay. I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not going to hurt you. Especially if you don't slow down. You get him? No, he ran fast, like, like really, really fast, conduit fast, man. Screw flesh eating death gaze. I don't want that. Well, don't be greedy. Funny thing, man. I just before every shot, you could see the neon sign behind him dim a little. Uh, must be his power source. Uh, head back to the sign. See what you can find. You should see what this guy can do, man. Like, lasers or something. I'm telling you, it would be great to have a one-two punch like that and smoke when I get to Augustine. Take it easy. We've got to find him again first. Yeah, you're done. I'm here. Any idea what I should be looking for? Just anything that might help with who our sniper is. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? <laughs> you should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What? What does that even mean? I, I don't know. It's just girled up. Girl stuff. Like... The name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting, and it is definitely the best-smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay, uh, look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. Okay, those definitely... Very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. Okay, I can see how you might think those are women's shoes. Yeah, they're like size negative. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That 
That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, we'll get lucky. You know, if I had smoke and lasers, I could, like, put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was, uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop. Okay, seriously, just stop. Okay, I'm thinking when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, whoom, smoke, and then once I got on the ropes, it's like zap, zap, I'll whip out the laser show. Good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. Name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this, found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death? A single puncture wound of unknown origin through the chest. I'm sending you the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. <sighs> sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah? Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That'd sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying what? The DUP is trying to scare people? I mean, their job is to control the panic. Yeah, that'll help. All right, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in progress. So now you do want me killing people with my powers? I didn't say kill them, just rough them up. Scare them a little. Destroy their stash. Nelson, I heard shots. D did you kill them? Hey, I was trying to do my duty as a citizen, man, but they were trying to do their duty as criminals. Damn it, the gate in front of the alley's locked. Ah, well, that didn't stop you back at the cannery. Whoa! Uh-oh, running on fumes here. Rich, you should see this man. Speedy gone crazy is a tagger. She's a pretty damn good one too. Yeah, well, don't forget admit, she's a murderer. Girl makes a mean vortex. Right. Pretty damn good one too. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. 
Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day while she chowders down. You know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I am on my way. 